So the one we're going to use is a profile tool path. So here I've chosen an eighth inch ball cutter and we can push calculate. So now we can open up CCAM Pro and now let's go do this conversion process. So we're going to go to vector turning and the first thing we need to do is import our G code and that has now been imported into the software for it to use and convert. Now we get to choose the tool that we want to use and so this is where we match the same again tool that we've been talking about the entire time a tapered ball cutter and we can go finish and save. So let's go generate that G code but you can see here that the software has converted all the Y axes to Z axis commands for us. So now let's go out to the machine and see what it does. The first thing that happens before the cutter even gets to the material is that it's going to continually rotate it at that 200 RPM speed. This turning process is always going to rotate this in a clockwise direction. And so if we cut from left to right, it will actually perform the entire cut as a Klein cut, giving us a much smoother finish. The ability to take a three axis G code toolpath, a profile toolpath, and convert it for this vector turning is a game changer. Again, all of these cutting advantages are pre-built into our CCAM Pro software and will be applied to every single one of these vector turning toolpaths.